Cincinnati set to host the 2018 edition of the American Athletic Conference Outdoor Track and Field Championships. Joined now by head coach Susan Seaton and uh, an exciting time uh, for this team and for this university. Yeah, very exciting. Uh, we've hosted before, but it's been a few years. And so uh, we're very excited to have some new facilities, uh, new resurface track, new hammer cage and uh, things like that to really, uh, you know, put, put on a, one heck of a show. Should be a great show this weekend and a great uh, showcase for the university. And uh, obviously your team comes in uh, having had some pretty good success here the last couple of years. Uh, the women's team, winners the last uh, two seasons, finally got that uh, indoor championship this year as well. But uh, that has to add to the excitement. Yeah, absolutely. Uh, when you're defending champion, uh, there's always a little extra pressure. Uh, I think our team is ready. They had some good team meetings uh, in the last few weeks. And, uh, you know, we're going to certainly go out there and uh put every uh, effort and uh, uh, forward we can and uh, have a great attitude about trying to repeat. And uh, taking a look uh, just at kind of the, the weekend as a whole, uh, starting on Friday, kind of highlighted by the multi-events, uh, the decathlon, uh, heptathlon, and uh, those are two events that you've had a lot of success at here uh, in recent time. Yeah, so those are uh, on the first uh, and second day of the championship, three-day meet, and we're really looking forward to seeing what our athletes can accomplish. Uh, we have a number of athletes competing in the women's heptathlon. Uh, defending champion uh, Naomi Urbano is uh, in the mix, as well as Angela Lightfoot. She had a really good season so far as well, and a few others. And then on the men's side, we got uh, our All-American Alex Bloom competing, as well as Ben Wollenslegel. So it should be, it should be a good, um, good event to watch. And then moving over to the uh, field events, obviously it's been a particular strength of this team. Uh, Adrian Valles uh, with the pole vault, uh, Loretta Blount on the high jump, uh, highlighting uh, many successful events for your team. Very good jumps, throws, but that has been a strength of this team through the years. Yeah, absolutely. It's always nice when you have all Americans in the mix uh, competing out there, and we sure hope that they will uh, make us proud here on our home track. They certainly have done that uh, throughout their careers and expecting more of the same here this weekend. And then, uh, obviously, the track event's very popular uh, amongst the fans, and uh, we'll have a lot of those finals coming up on Sunday. Those have been very good to you in the past. Uh, a lot of great athletes have, uh, have kind of cemented their status with them. Uh, Tiana Lattimore, in particular, I think, uh, you know, we saw what she did last year for you guys in the relays, but uh, competing uh, just down the road from where she went to high school has to be very special to her. Yeah, we really hope that she will have a good hometown crowd here supporting her, uh, you know, having uh, grown up just right across the street from us at use and uh, you know she is a sophomore now and uh, understands a little bit more how uh, conference championships work and she's really fired up and wants to put on a great show for everyone. I'm sure, sure she will, uh, given what she uh, showed us last year and uh, here during her sophomore season. Well, a lot of excitement uh, stemming from this uh, upcoming uh, track and field championships. Glad to have it here at uh, UC and uh, we'll catch up with you this weekend, coach. Yeah, thanks and go Bearcats. All right, that's head coach Susan Seaton as UC set to host the 2018 American Athletic Conference Track and Field Outdoor Championships.